Are you a consultant with lots of jewelry and you're tired of taking the jewelry off your wall to show it? Well, guess what? I have something for you. This is just a little treat. As you can see and scroll through some of the pictures right there, you're going to see an awesome, awesome way of using the minimal amount of material to get an awesome, awesome display. So if you are ready, I'm ready to give you all the information that you need. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel. Hey, 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 what's up? Welcome to my YouTube channel, Straight From The Closet. It's your girl, Anthony Coward. I am back. And guess what? I'm back with an awesome, awesome idea. So you guys know I am a paparazzi consultant, consultant ID 103460, brand owner of Lush Jewels. If you would like to get some information on becoming a consultant, feel free to inbox me on Facebook. You can DM me on Instagram or you can just send me an email and my information will be listed below in the description. All right, so what I wanna show you guys is this neat little way to have a bag party. So it's either gonna be a bag party or if you're somewhere like at a hair salon or nail salon and you don't want your customers to have to look through items like this, that's all wrapped up and they can barely even see what it is when it's a, such a gorgeous piece, you wanna display it. So guess what I have come up with? Well, I'm sorry, let me just put a disclaimer out there. This is not my idea. I actually got this idea from another consultant. I just put my own little twist on it. All right, so you guys see here, this is a three inch binder, nice large binder. Now this is blue. I would really prefer like black or white, but this is what I had on hand. So this is what I've done. I've added in some little inserts to just say bling. I have my, um, my brand name on it, my label, bling it on, and then I just have a couple of pictures on the back of it, okay? So most of the binders have the whole plastic front, so you can go ahead and add you in a little insert there. That'll just talk a little bit about the business, you know, $5 accessories, all that good stuff. So, inside of this, guys, are pages and pages of beautiful jewelry packs that you can sell. And so add, you can give your customers this binder, and then they can just kind of flip through and find items that they're interested in, okay? And then this gives you an opportunity to do like an upsell as well. So you see how you have the necklace down here and then the ring, and then you add in a little bracelet right there. So that right there is a $15 set, right? Necklace down here, bracelet up here, that's a $10 set. So that's an easy way to give your customers something to look at. Opposed to saying, here guys, this is what I'm selling. Go ahead and look at that. They can see it because it's displayed. Now, let me show you how this is done. Super easy. Get you some cardstock paper, okay? Pack of cardstock, you can get it from the dollar store. If you wanna get it in white, you can get it from the dollar store or you can order it on Amazon or um, Staples. You can get it from Staples as well. So you get you some eight, eight um, and a half by 11 pages, right? You can cut that into four. So you'll end up with four squares just like this. You take the squares and you add little slits on the side. So now you have openings just like this. So you see that little opening there? You take your piece, lay it on there, put the chain on the inside if you're doing necklaces, okay? Hook the earrings right on the top, just like that, so this way the whole set is displayed. You're gonna get these cellophane bags that you can purchase from Amazon. They're really, really cheap. I think I paid $7.49 for 100. And they are resealable cellophane bags, okay? Resealable cellophane bags right on Amazon. I will drop the link in the comments and in the section below, okay? So then you simply take this, add it into your cellophane packet. Make sure that you got everything in there. You wanna make sure you have the chain in the back because you wanna be able to show them that there's additional um, links so the chain can kind of extend down if they needed to. And you know, adjust it as needed. You wanna make it a good presentation. You don't want it to be just kind of thrown in there. So you're gonna adjust it as needed. I'm gonna show you in just a moment. Of course, the chain is acting funky. But I hope everybody's doing well. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, so you can get these little neat ideas. Um, and that's what I love about paparazzi is that we can share ideas with people, other consultants. And so once you get that in there nice and neat, you have a cute little package and it's resealable. So if you purchase a ring or a bracelet at a later date and you haven't sold it, you know you can always open it up and simply add in your ring. So there you go. That's a cute little packet. All you simply have to do is add all of your 
pieces to cardstock and slip it right in your little slip covers on the inside of the binder. So you're gonna have something that looks like this. Okay, so this is one that I started on and when it is the earrings that are already in the plastic, I just leave it in there. Save on your cellophane bags, you don't have to worry about using a bunch of them. All right, so you add that right in. It's like a picture album, y'all, except it's a jewelry album. Cute, right? This is like your album sale in virtual reality. All right, so then you take that. Nice and simple. And you take these. So these you can also get from the, the dollar store. They're just um, document protectors. And so you, I think you get like 50 or so in a pack. And so once you get that, you take your completed pack and you just slip it right in. Yep, I'm totally doing it upside down, y'all. Totally doing it upside down. So you take it. You add it in the little slip, all right? And the reason why I put the tape on um, the back of these guys is just simply because I don't want it to be moving around because you're gonna be traveling with your bag and so you don't want it to, be, to move around. And so now you have it in a nice little pack so they can see what they're purchasing. And always try to add pieces that are like pieces, okay? And then you just simply take this, add it to your binder, Lock it up and you're done. That's easy. Something very easy and it, it can slip right into a bag. Um, you can carry it in whatever. You, if you have a big pocketbook, you can put that in there. I mean, it's a huge binder, so you got to be carrying something big. But these are really, really neat ways. You can even put these in a nice little box. So if you're, you know, if you're going to an event or something like that and you don't want to put it in the binder, you can always take them out of your binder and add them into a nice little pretty box that you have created. And then this way, um, your customers don't have to touch your jewelry, but they can see it and they can see everything that's in the pack. All right. So hopefully this was helpful, guys. And you literally only need. Cardstock paper, a three inch binder, cellophane packs, tape, and scissors. Go ahead and invest in your business and take it to the next level. All right, so make sure that you like this video if it was helpful. Um, please tune in for future videos. I'm always looking to try to take my business to the next level. All right, see you guys later. Thanks so much.